If you have something that really needs to stick together, you might need something stronger than super glue. One UNF professor has created a glue that sticks even better. So here to explain, me, it's meso glue, right? I'm meso glue. Meso glue. That's okay. Correct. And show us just how well it works, Dr. Steven Stagon. I'm so anxious to see this because um, he's going to let me test it, and I'm, I'm so excited. How did you come up with this idea, by the way? Okay, so as an engineer, I'm a mechanical engineering professor, and you face problems all the time. Our job is to make people's lives better. Uh, so it was really frustrating for me when a group of students that were working on a medical device project tried to glue together plastic and polished stainless steel. So in gluing these two things together with super glue, which is biocompatible, that means you can put it in the yeah. body, um, they just fall apart and the results were really inconsistent. Oh. So we had a lot of what's called statistical spread in the data. Mm -hmm. What it means for you is that it your stuff's work. gonna break. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it didn't so say. <laughs> very simple. Okay, so you're gonna have me start with this is this right here is the conventional super glued piece. So, okay. so what we have is just a piece of polished stainless steel, mm -hmm. really nice material, um, very biocompatible. And then we have a piece of plastic. This is high density polyethylene. You probably see this all over your house. Water bottles are sometimes low density polyethylene. So you can imagine trying to super glue two water bottles together. Okay, yeah. Just yep. go ahead and all pull right. that apart. So, that, okay, that was like nothing. Yeah. I mean, that was so, really, that, so that was super glue. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's really okay. You see, so it takes about 20 pounds to do that, maybe not even that much. All right. This one has been glued together with meso glue, where we take um, metallic nano rods and put them onto the plastic. Try to pull that one apart. Okay. I have a feeling I'm not going to be able to pull it apart. Um, I almost broke it. I mean, it's like I could probably get it, but it's really hard. So that one is four times stronger, and what you're actually breaking is the plastic and not the glue. That's, yeah, I could see that. It actually, yeah came off and let me see compared to this one. Oh wait, yeah. No damage. Oh, no, there's no, yeah, no. Okay, so what is this stuff? I mean, how does it, I mean, you're, you're explaining, you're going way over my head with, with the science. Is it a liquid? Can I just like put it on there? How does it work? No, so currently we're right now in phase one. We're trying to get this out there to the consumer. Right now, uh, we have to put it in a machine called a physical vapor deposition machine. That's just a fancy word for metal coating machine. Okay. So we take this stuff, we put it in there, we pump all the air out of there, and then we shoot metal at it, and it grows nano rods. It grows just like grass, actually. Really? Except it's not alive. It's metal. It's metal. Yeah. Okay. So when we grow these things, we're able to use the metallic nano rods, and uh, they have different properties than a big piece of metal. This piece of metal reacts very hard, very rigid, mm -hmm. but when you get it really small, it acts almost like bubble gum. So if you can think of the analogy, if I take my fingers and make them into bubble gum, and then push them together, you have a continuous thing of bubble gum. Instead, we didn't use bubble gum. We used metal. You used metal. So I, I know you, you know you were saying about just the average person using this, but mm -hmm. I, I bet there's a you know you have higher goals. Yes. Well, um, where do you anticipate this being really valuable? Well, uh, we just did a program with the National Science Foundation mm -hmm. called Innovation Core. I was the mentor for the team. It involves the two other co-inventors, and uh, that's looking at commercializing the product. So right now we're trying to use this in computers to make oh, to make them run faster. That would be great. You can get more heat from the CPU to the heat sink. You can run your computer faster. All right. Well, come back when you're a bazillionaire after you're well, <laughs> after you I'll bring my Ferrari back for the two okay. grannies. <laughs> <laughs> or, or for the, um, or for the, um, the, the Jacksonville, the, the, yeah, <laughs> the Jacksonville beauty queens. That would work too. Absolutely. Thank you so much for coming on. All Thank right, we posted a link on the morning show page of newsportjacks.com where you can learn more about meso glue. Jen, over to you.